Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody emailed me tonight wanting to know how to do a text effect with like ink splatter. And I actually could find one on the internet. Um, see if I still have it up. Ink splatter. And it just came up and I traced it. It traced really good. So. We're going to go and we're going to do two different kinds, two different effects. We're going to do this one, which is just a power clip. And then this one, we're going to do totally opposite, which is pretty neat effect. That would engrave pretty cool and be more of a grunge effect, maybe. So I've just got the word text written out. I'm going to, let's zoom in here a little bit. Let's uh, take our text and put no fill. So I'll left click, right click. This is all grouped together. I'm going to go up to object, power clip, place inside frame. And then there's your first one. And you can edit that, you know, by moving the text around to get you the way you want it. And then the second way, which would be kind of equally cool, I just took that exact same clip art of a ink splatter and all I did was take out the fill and put it in outline because it is, I traced it in this vector and it traced really well so we're going to left click no fill right click this now we're just going to put the text on top of this now let's zoom in here and take our smart fill tool and just fill in and you can fill in and leave some parts out. Um, you know, maybe just play around with it to your discretion, what you think looks the best. And then take your ink away and you have this. Of course, you would want to change the outline to a black a little thicker, so you could maybe even thicker than that, so you could see that that part of the E, and that's too much. But it kind of gives you a grunge effect or a, an aged effect. You know, might look good. Uh, play around with that; it's pretty cool. Uh, so that's two ways to do it: uh, the clip art one or the color fill, doing basically the opposite. I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.